in the previous part we have seen the uses of trees and different type of trees we have also seen what is deforestation and how it affects now we are going to see how to conserve the trees as we know trees are very valuable if we conserve tree it will help us protect our resources like water soil air and animals hence there are some simple ways to conserve the tree first one is planting more and more trees trees should be planted especially in those areas where forest have been destroyed today the government and the private organizations are taking steps towards planting more and more trees that is a forestation second cutting down of trees in a systematic way systematic way it means only some of the trees from an area according to the need according to the need whatever we are planning according to that only we need to cut the trees the tree that remains prevent soil erosion they also make seeds for the new grow next is preventing fire fire causes a lot of destruction the entire vegetation gets burnt the fire may be caused due to the carelessness of people carelessness of people means many of the time when we visit the forest area either we leave the camp fire bone fire made by us or by many other ways which affects the vegetation of that area or it may also be caused by natural methods of lightning we cannot control the lightning but we can control the human things the human activities like we should be careful not to make a bonfire or use matchstick near the trees next is preventing trees from diseases and pests many trees are destroyed by diseases and insects so such trees need to be cut down and plant different trees over there and give the insecticides and pesticides for the other trees near that tree now preventing plants from overgrazing overgrazing by animals like sheep goats and cattle must be prevented this eat small plants or trample on them means they destroy by walking on them sometimes the roots and trunks of plants are damaged due to cattle so we need to prevent that thing one mahotsav one mahotsav is a annual festival during which trees are planted thousands of trees are planted every year on this day many schools take part in this by planting the trees or by means saplings and participating in debates discussions and drawing competitions what is the use of this this will provide an basic information about the trees and how the trees are useful for us in the school life this also helps to prevent and conserve the forest all of us should participate in one more so by planting trees in our neighborhood planting the trees in the forest is only not useful we should also plant the trees near our areas and take care of that 
the chipko movement in in the year 1974 there was a huge protest against cutting down of trees in the forest of himalayas now what exactly had happened the women's nearby that areas they formed a circle around the trees and did not allow the contractors of the forest department to cut down the trees this movement gradually spread throughout the india and became an movement which was known as chipko movement the women near the areas used to enter the forest whenever these contractors come and they used to hug or embrace the trees due to which this movement was named as chipko movement also the slogan was given if you cut one tree plant at least three other trees this was the motto of chipko movement which was ultimately the movement to conserve the forests